Alrighty guys, what is up and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a little collaboration with... Sorry. So today I'm going to film a little collaboration for you guys for a fall inspired look with hair and makeup featuring Alana Davis. So I'm going to film a collaboration today with Alana Davis. And we're going to do... That's how I did my mouth. <laughs> Sorry. And we are going to do a everyday fall makeup look, so with a dark lip, because I know you guys really wanted to see that, and then a sleek hairstyle that you can wear out. And a sleek hairstyle that you can do at home for every day as well. That will bring you from day to night. I'm going to love We're editing this. Together. I know. <laughs> the bloopers. Today I'm doing a collaboration with Alana Davis <laughs> featuring an everyday fall makeup look with a nice bold dark lip and a hairstyle you can do at home that will bring you from day to night. So let's get started. Let's start off with the makeup look and we have some very cool products. So we have Charlotte Tilbury, Armani Beauty, and anything else? Um, yeah, we have Too Faced, okay. which is really cool. And then before we are even starting this makeup, yes. um, she exfoliated oh, yeah. with Alana Davis Micro Scrub, which you love. This feels so good. My right. skin is like so soft and supple, like a and, baby. <laughs> and then to add to that, the Is Clinical Youth Complex. Um, which is super lightweight and it's a botanical based skincare line and it's just phenomenal and I love using it as a base for makeup. Right. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to start with just clearing her complexion. Like this is like for fall, like no one wants cakey makeup. I mean, yeah. even in the summer, no one wants cakey makeup. So the emphasis of the season right now is healthy skin, glowy skin. So we're going to use products that really show that nothing too heavy really soft really beautiful so to achieve that number one i'm going to use the charlotte tilbury light wonder foundation i love this foundation. i've never used it okay. i'm super excited it's kind of like a bump up and i use the back of my hand do okay. you mind no i not at all so i'm just going to on the back of my hand mix two colors i'm mixing a five and a two because you have a beautiful glow okay and I'm just using a MAC 159 brush. I just love this brush because it's just so great for foundation. So what I like to do is whenever I apply the Charlotte Tilbury Tinted Moisturizer, I always like to apply just a little bit. Just pat, press it in with my finger. You know, there's nothing better than a little bit of heat when you're doing your complexion because it just helps the product blend. It helps everything melt into your skin and all that good stuff. So it's really, really great. And then underneath the eyes as well, around the nose, tip of the nose. So just a nice, even coverage. So the other great thing is that she just got like all of her Botox and all of her fillers in her face. So everything's still really fresh. <laughs> no. <laughs> You'd be like, no bitch, my face moves. Okay, so she just did both sides. So you can see my skin is super even. And this is with the Charlotte Tilbury. I feel like I have like flawless skin right now. I just need some concealer because you guys know my under eye bags are like not the greatest. So next we're gonna conceal and we're gonna use NARS um, Creamy Radiant Concealer. I love this concealer. It's so good. It's like the only one that has full coverage. Yeah, and I remember I heard you mentioning that you're gonna we're gonna use Honey, which is a good color um, because you have a tan. But yes, we're gonna do this last. Oh. Okay, well, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm doing more natural looks, I like to do complexion first, just to like even everything out. Um, I mean, she has flawless skin, but you know, there is still like a little bit of redness just from mm -hmm. the weather and all that good stuff. So Armani is like the bomb.com. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do this Eyes to Kill, and this color is Stellar. It's like a bronzy sparkle. It's, oh my god, how many people does it take to focus a freaking bronze? There we go! Ooh, look at the shine. It's so beautiful. Look at that shine. Okay, so I'm gonna take this color and I'm gonna go all over her lid with it, but I'm gonna add a little bit of dimension with their um, highlighting bronzer. It's so, this is like literally my favorite product right now. It looks so natural on my skin. And it's just like, 
it's I love really the packaging. Really I know. I love the shape. So anyway, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and I'm gonna take my Mac 224 brush. I mean, this is a classic brush, and I'm just gonna apply a little bit of this. And I'm going to go all over. And the reason why I'm doing it with the brush first is because I want it to be very, very soft. How many times have I said very, very soft in this video? Okay, guys. So we just had to continue the video. We're going to start with the eyes, but we continued it on an iPhone XS. So maybe you guys can tell us if you like the quality versus my camera quality. And maybe I should just get a new phone instead of investing in a $2,000 camera. <laughs> I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. But yeah, let's continue. So next I'm going to take um, the Armani highlighter. Mm -hmm. And I'm just going to take the tip of the 224 brush. And we're going to just add a little bit to the inner corner. A little bit to her brow bone. I still haven't filled in her brow. So I'm going to do that last. I'm just going to go back into the pot and I'm just going to use my finger as I'm going to take this MAC 212 brush. This is like a flat angled brush, which I love. And I'm just going to really load this up and I'm just going to line, look up for me, right close to her lash line. I'm just going to really smoke that out. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to continue on with the other side. But what I really want to explain to you guys is um, the reason why I'm using a fluffy brush and my finger is because my finger, when I'm applying it, the pressure is much more dense. When you're doing a look that you want to be super airy, then you're going to use this really fluffy brush and you're just going to like dust it on basically. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with a brow pencil. And I'm just going to start at the bottom of her brow and then just brush it in because I don't want too much. And my eyebrows are tinted, so it's a little bit easier to fill them, I think, too, now. Yeah, for sure. There. Perfect. Yeah, I love when you do my brows. Last time you killed it too. They're like so, I love when they're like bushy. And yeah. Mean. Next, we're going to go in with this concealer by NARS. And what I like about the doe foot is that you can really shape where you want it. I never put this much on. I'm excited. Yeah. Let's see how you do this. Well, the thing is that I'm gonna, we're going to blend this all the way out. And look at that. And see how flawless. Yes, covering the bag. Look at the difference. It's such a beautiful, and that's the thing. That's why, like, that's why it looked like we were applying a lot, but we really yeah. weren't. We were applying such thin layers. We were just applying, like, to more areas than you're probably used to. Turn that way. The other way. Oh, my God. It's so good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the other side. <laughs> <laughs> so now what we're going to do is we're going to add, okay, Armani. Ooh. Set. What's the right. other colors Some we have? beautiful colors. Okay, so this one here is a nice red it's they're all matte so this is from the matte rouge collection and this color is 400 this one i like for every day and this is like a really soft pink number 500 and then this one here is a number 200 which is a coppery sort of brown so it's so beautiful let's try this one let's do it so oh, try. i'm nervous well you know what i like about these lipsticks is that the way that they're angled, it's like I don't even need like a lip liner brush. So we're going to apply it straight from the tube. I am so bad. Can you tell? <laughs> I think it's all over my teeth right now. Okay. So funny. It was fuck. It looks fucking good on you. Really? It looks so Really? Good. I'm so yeah. excited to hear that. This is so fucking <laughs> You have a Q-tip? I'm not even gonna look. Is yeah. it or is it good? Look. Oh, it's good? Yeah. It feels like... Oh, it's... Yeah, it is good. <laughs> but I have to clean it up. Hold up. See, look at my eyes. They just like... Yeah. Let me see. I feel like a little angel. They're so... With <laughs> devilish lips. <laughs> okay, so we just finished the lip. Oh. And I think, yeah, it totally adds to the look. Like, it's amazing. Look at this contour. Look at this contour. Bam. Look at the lip. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, love this. Guys, get this color. Get this color. It looks good on all skin tones. I mean, Indian to... White. <laughs> no, I'm actually half Spanish, guys. So I'm like half, not Latina, but like I'm a Mediterranean. Mediterranean <laughs> mix. I can tell. Yeah? Yeah. Really? By your eyebrows. Really? No. <laughs> My mom actually has the same eyebrows as me. Really? Well, I got them from her, but yeah. Yeah, anyway. So that's it, right? That's it for makeup. No. Okay, so hair. Hair. Let's do this. Okay. I'm gonna take just an elastic, and I'm gonna bring her hair together, and I'm gonna put it pretty low. You can make it this as high as you want. I just want it really low. But see all like this, these frizzies? Like, I don't mind that. This adds to that messy, effortless look. And we're gonna get a nice ponytail. Boom, easy. We're gonna tie a knot. So you're gonna take the hair, you're gonna go through, and you're gonna pull the end out. When you pull the end out, you're gonna really hold on to it and push it back towards her head. Now I'm gonna to start to pin while I'm holding this little piece of hair. What's your biggest pet peeve? My biggest pet On someone peeve? else, actually. Uh, oh my God, do you know what I hate? What? Two things. Okay. I hate when someone's telling me a story and they're like, oh my God, I have to tell you something. I'll tell you later. Oh my God, I hate that Like, too. don't do that, number one. Yes. Number two, I hate when you're talking to someone and they're like, they're, tra they're, tra they're being condescending, but they're just like, in my opinion, you know, I so believe yeah and it's just like okay like obviously it's your opinion because it's coming out of your freaking mouth yeah. like i hate that oh that's so true how about you i was thinking of more like physical things oh sorry <laughs> no no that's good mine is not as like i don't know okay when girls necklaces are like twisted in the chain the back part is like hanging I'm, out like, checking mine right now. i was checking mine that's why i thought of it i oh, okay. hate that i think it's so like i'm like fix it even though like they don't know right you know i hate that i um, hate okay so then if it comes to that stuff i hate when someone's lipstick is on and it's like a bright lip and it's like messy it's oh, like all is. out of the line and oh, it's like oh, it's like girl like get a lip liner or get a lip brush so this is how we have our pony. So just these little guys here, we're not gonna pin them like crazy. So I'm just gonna use a little bit of the Orbe um, Super Fine Hairspray. I'm just gonna spray and I'm gonna hold. Love it. Put a little bit of spray in your bang area. Christine's going out tonight, so. This is true. She's all pouty. I honestly always like my hair down like this when it's like, tight because it looks like clean and it looks put together but it's very effortless that's just it and just like you know you want to add like a little bit of detail so you can just have like your side bird hanging out a little bit love a good side bird alrighty guys and there you have it this is the fall hair and makeup look thank you Alana you look so good you killed it thank you and thank you guys so much for watching again if you like this kind of video let us know in the comments below and we'll film more tutorials for you can't wait peace out freaking out that it's gonna die the battery looks like like it's dying again but it's oh internal temperature high